Nothing makes a teacher happier than asking you which sets of quantum numbers are incorrect. Now, you're gonna be given sets of numbers, an N, an L, an ML, and an MS. These are the four quantum numbers for an electron in an atom. We're gonna start with N, the principal quantum number. It's allowed to be any whole number starting with one. So one, two, three, four, any whole number you want. You generally won't see anything bigger than seven, but any number is allowed as long as it's a whole positive number. Three, four, and five are all valid. So none of these n values here are illegal. But then the values of L that you're allowed to have depend on your n. So for an electron in the third energy level, the L is allowed to be zero or one or and you count all the way up to one less than this. So for n equals three, the maximum L is two. You're allowed to have an L of zero, one, or two here. An L of three is not allowed. And so if you have an electron where L and N are the same, that's not okay. L also isn't allowed to be more than N. There's a maximum and it's n minus one. When n is four, the highest L allowed is three. When n is five, the highest L allowed is four, and one is less than four. And uh, when n is three, the maximum L is two, and one is less than two. So A is incorrect. But this one also says which sets, so maybe another one's incorrect. Let's go find out. ML is then based off of L. You have to count from whatever negative L is all the way up to whatever positive L is. So, well, A is already fake news, so we're not even gonna worry about that anymore. But when L is three, the allowed values of ML are negative three, negative two, negative one, and I'm counting all the way up to positive three. Two is in that range and therefore is allowed here. When L is one, for electrons in the fifth energy level that also have L equals one, ML is allowed to be negative one up to positive one. And so negative one is allowed there as well. When L is one, ML is allowed to be negative one or zero or positive one, but it cannot be beyond what L actually is. That means this ML is not allowed for that L. So we already have two sets of quantum numbers that are incorrect here. The only other restriction is that MS, the spin quantum number, has to be plus a half or minus a half. And all of these are, so none of these are illegal either. The answer to my question is A and D. They are incorrect. But that's because this L was too high for that N and this ML was too high for that particular L. I recognize that when N is three, L is allowed to be two, but that's not what this says. This restriction is specific to electrons in that subshell. And when the electrons have L equals one, ML is certainly not two. Cool. I hope this was helpful to you and that you were able to go through your question as I went along with mine. Thank you for being with me and best of luck.